I've noticed these little tiny bugs over here on these cardone flowers. Really tiny, I can't really tell what they are. Looks like a fly. Very small. There's several of them over here. Who else stopped by to do a little feeding? I think this is a male jumping spider and he's uh, sitting here enjoying his breakfast. Come on, you can do it. Don't be shy, come on. Come on, you can do it. Okay, let's let her rip. Let's see what we got. All right, I'm zooming in. It's a bee, a cold bee. Okay, this is a mining bee or a leaf cutter, right? Something like that. It was up in the eaves of the house here. Okay, we're out of focus. So okay. We got the telemacro view. I'm trying to spin Maybe we can things ID a little. Now. Starting to warm up, see he's breathing a little faster. Very pretty. Is that pollen on the thorax? I don't know. Could be hair. It's probably hair. Yeah, I just can't tell on the screen. Okay, let's get a facial. Try to get a different angle. But wisely, I'll catch another one. Do this. I can't see it. Oh, there we go. Moving too fast. Yeah, really cooking now. 
Watch out. Goodbye. It's a bee okay, there it is. That's what the bees have when they fly around to go in their nests. That's what they're taking in there. This is what they carry around. Looks like ball of pollen. Ball of pollen with maybe some petals. Maybe. Chewed petals in it or something? Something chewed up, huh? All right, I've been out here for a few days trying to hunt down these green bees. Out here in the prickly pear patch. Now you can see from this wide angle there's a lot of flowers and there's a lot of bees over here. Most of these bees are mason bees or chimney bees and uh, occasionally some honey bees. But every once in a while I see a green one. So let's take a closer look at all of these bees. Okay, there's a good shot of one, mason bee, I think. I see pollen on the belly, in the lower part of the abdomen. There's one, appears to have it on his legs there. Very good lighting. Come on, show us. What do you look like? Nice. Lots of pollen. Dig it. Fill it up. Yummy. Okay, turn around. Okay, let's see how clear this is. Get right up in there. All right. This one's trying to get in a closed up flower. Let's get in there real close. You made it. Okay, now I'm on telemacro mode with the tripod so we can hopefully get a good shot this way. I'm not sure though. Looks like another mason bee. Guess who else likes green bees? That's right, this is a spider. Shake things up a little there. You really see all the lights washed out. Turn around. Nice. Couple going here. You guys gonna give us some close ups? All 
Hard to see, you move too fast. Is somebody clean in there? Face or something there? There's a good face shot. About as close as I can get. Thanks a lot. Want to leave now? Okay. You can go. There you go. There's some prickly pear barbs in my skin. All right, all right. Let's see your face. Up close, please. There's our green bee. And hold it. Oh. Come on. Hope that's a good shot there. Shaky. Where'd you go? Give us some tongue action. Do it. Okay, there's a small one. Small mason bee. There's a small mason bee. This is another type of bee, I think. Maybe a wasp. Oh, 
Well, I'm not finding the green bees, but I found a green fly. Chilling out. Hanging. Nice red eyes. Look at the eyes. See if we can get in real close on this fly. You're a star. Definitely some green in there. See your wing pattern? That might help us. Can't get much closer than this. Okay, fly. How big are you? I'd say one centimeter, maybe. Okay, it's kind of a windy day, so the audio might be a little bad today. But uh, I'm gonna set it up here anyway on this flower. Zoom in as far as I can. And maybe go for a telemacro on this one. It's nice and bright in the sunlight here. Yeah, I think we can get a little closer with the telemacro. There we go. Oop, can't see it. Just, just a little. Nice view there. Couple bees. Okay, let's try some more. There's some kind of bug running around inside this flower. What is it? A bee. There's the star of the show. Can't catch it. Tell a macro of a green bee. There she is. Get a good shot of her. Don't hide. Oh no. What happened? It's not lit up enough, I don't think. It's very blurry now. Okay, she's gone. Okay, there she is. Let's go ahead and get closer. It's a windy day, so it's going to be kind of noisy. Okay, I'm going to try a telemacro shot of this bee. She's really small. Come on, girl. Come on out to the light. Don't be shy. There you go. Get yourself clean. There she is.
Thank you, ma'am. Looking good. Been a rough day today. Kind of windy. There's another pretty face. Couple. Not now. Be nice, you guys. Well, hopefully, I got some good shots in there. Lots of bees. Good close-ups, maybe? Boy, they move quick. Look at all the pollen. That's right, go all the way around. Okay, it's really windy, but there's a green bee. The chimney bees are really at it today. They're outnumbering the mason bees, which I was seeing the other day. Maybe they're better at flying around in the wind. What kind of beetles we got down there in the bottom, I can't tell. Maybe a few different things down there. hidden down there under the pedal. Looks like she's stuck. Been working too hard, girl. It's telemacro, but I don't think it's focusing at the right distance. Maybe. Whoa. She sure looks bright in the sunlight, though. Okay, I'm gonna have to stop. We're running out of battery power, madam. I can't really see what's going on, though. sitting there now. Not sure. She may 
Maybe she's just resting. Okay, what's going on now? Something's going on in here. The bite? Looks like a bite. She doesn't look too good. She's still moving a little. That. Something's wrong. Alright, I think that's probably gonna do it for the video for today. Look at all the action now that I leave. Okay, you guys can have the flowers. I think that's plenty of prickly pear for now. And this is just one of the many. We'll let the wind take us out.